review of the Creed 2 version 4 on Samsung Galaxy Y. Let's get started. There's a lock screen. Very nice. And uh, here's the phone app. Let me make a quick call. There is a nice seller, I must say. Let's make a call. There is a dial screen. Here you got the contacts app. You can see your, all your contacts here. Uh, again, let's make a quick call. There's a messaging app. You got a lot of settings here. Uh, you can choose between the different screens of the messaging app. Uh, the default Edge, Gloss, Keynote, Memo, and uh, you can also choose between the text message limit. For example, if you have uh, 2,000 or 3,000 messages, you can increase the text message limit by tapping the plus sign. So, the room is fast, cool, very nice. Uh, there's a free toolbox. Here we get all the options. If you want to back up your contacts and SMS, you can back up. Back up in store. You also get the Samsung secret codes. So quite fun. You can also take screenshot here. Okay. Now if, you want, if I want to take a screenshot. Here's the series bar. Uh, here are the doggles. Uh, I want to uh, tell you something that uh, th when you first crash this room, you won't be able to uh, run the Wi-Fi. I mean, what the when you connect to the internet, the browser will not not load. For this, you have to install a kernel. Like I have installed a kernel, headlocks kernel here. Uh, quite fast, nice animations, cool city star modes. Here are the feed parts. You can choose between the Windows animation speed, normal, fast, slow, very slow. Here are the city star modes. Here is a beam screen. The animation when you log your screen and unlock it. Here is a calendar app. Calculator. Clock. Very nice interface. Well, those who are having problem in download, downloading the album art, just uh, go to the settings and sing album art. Very fast and nice. 
ब्रेक लगे आगे But the one thing is that uh, you won't be able to end the applications. Like it has not got no task manager here. For this, you have to uh, do a complicated process. I will give you the link in the description. So you have to go to the task manager, the application box, and then in the all applications. RAM consumption is very good. You can see here. Mm, not much to show here. Or uh, I think that's it. Okay, guys. Thanks for watching. Please. Great comment and subscribe.